welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. Today I'm back with my July planner kit lineup video. I do post my planner kit lineup videos a little bit late because, you know, I just think for internet security reasons, I would rather people didn't know where I was at all times. So I do always post them a little bit late, but people still seem to enjoy them. So I do put them up. This one is coming later than I should have put it up because I've just realized that the kit that I thought I was waiting on is actually for a week that's primarily in August. Um, so I'm not really sure what I was waiting for. So I apologize that this one is probably even later than they usually are but anyway we are here now so the first thing I wanted to do was give you an update on the kit that I'm planning to use for the week of the 26th of June to the 2nd of July so this would have been in my June kit lineup video but I am pretty sure I have changed the kit since then I don't think this kit was in there so apologies if it was but I'm pretty sure it wasn't so I'll show you it instead so this is the studious kit from planner phase it's a relatively new release I do PR for planner phase and just to let you know things have changed a little bit I'll explain it just because I think this might be the first video that goes up where I'm properly talking about it so the PR team have changed up a little bit we've got some new members of the PR team and our codes have changed to just be our name so the code that you will use if you want to save now if you wanted to use my code is no longer cat 10 it's just cat but you will still save 10% so that hasn't changed we are not having PR freebies anymore there are seasonal freebies instead there are six to collect they're all in a matching theme and I think they are really good if you are looking for a kind of like kits for smaller planners particularly journals bullet journals anything like that the six freebies coordinate would would make a really cute autumnal spread so I really love that idea and you can select one of the six if there's particular things that you would be really looking for or Anna will just put one in at random but it works similarly to the PR freebies that you can kind of collect the set but these ones really make a set so I think it's such a fun move just to let you know as well that there have been some changes so I do still get PR credit for being on Anna's PR team but I will get additional points on the planner face website if you use my code uh, it's a kind of reward system now so it means even more to me than it ever did if you do use my code when you shop with Anna it just means a lot to kind of help support your favorite creator so if you can add my code it makes a big difference so thank you so much okay so the the kit that I've put in for the week of the 26th of June to the 2nd of July is this one studious I love this kit I love the art and this one is real kind of obviously school vibes. I was going to be saving this for like September, October. I work in education. I don't work in a school, but I do work in education. But I decided to bring it back because this was like a really, really busy week at work. And I just felt, you know, I have trouble fitting everything in in September. Just the nature of like Stuart's birthday is then. My anniversary with him is then. We've got a wedding that we're going to this September as well. It's Anna's birthday in September. So like a lot happens in September. So I actually decided that I would move this from September to now to make sure that I could use it. So I'm really excited to use this one. And even though I don't really work with students of this age group, I just love the vibe. So... <laughs> I decided I wanted to put it in. I'm really excited about that one. Then we have the week of the 3rd to the 9th of July. And I have shown this kit already before. So this is also from Planner Phase. And this was the June 2023 mystery called Fairy Tale Party. I do work with Anna on the Planner Phase mystery. So I help come up with themes, mood boards, clip art lists, all that kind of stuff. I'm very involved in the mystery. This is one of my favourite ones we've ever done. And I really, really want to use it. I don't want to hoard it, which is what I do with most kits. And I was going to use it back in June. So I have already showed this in the Planner Kit line of video because I was going to use it for we went to a like outdoor music uh, like an outdoor musical um, and so I felt that this was quite a good fit for that and the musical was a little night music so if you don't know that's a Sondheim musical it's not a fairy tale or anything but it you know it kind of has like whimsical music vibes so I did feel like this was potentially a good fit but the 3rd to the 9th of July is when we went to see Billy Joel and I was going to be using like a um, what is the kit called thank you for the stickers from Planner Phase which is a real kind of rock gig one but Billy Joel was at Hyde Park so it was outdoor and I just felt like actually this one was really the vibes of that whole thing like it was quite sort of like there were sort of hippie vibes and there was a lot of like bohemian elements to it obviously Billy Joel is like known as the piano man so having a piano in there is a really good fit for him so even though this one is a party theme I think I'm really leaning into the kind of musical and bohemian elements to it so I've decided to move this one I cannot remember what kit I have put in instead because obviously this one wasn't oh I think this was probably the week before so this I think that's where that swap has happened potentially <laughs> uh, but yeah I think this is going to be a really good fit 
Uh, so I'm really excited to use this one. So that's what I'm going to be using for that week. Then the week after that is the week of the 10th to the 16th of July. And this is the week that I went to see the Little Mermaid because I went to see it very late. And I have a number of Little Mermaid kits. Like I actually had this one in until like just before this video, which is the part of your world kit from Squirrel Prince Co. But this is obviously like original Ariel rather than the new Little Mermaid. And I didn't buy either. So Darcy or Jess both drew uh, Little Mermaid up. I didn't buy either of them because I just felt like I didn't need to buy another Little Mermaid kit because I had so many Little Mermaid kits. But then when it came to actually like planning out what kits to use for this week, I was like, oh, I don't know. Like, do I really want to use an original Little Mermaid kit for like the new Little Mermaid? So then another option that I was considering was this one, which is the April 2022 mystery from Pink Diamond Planico because this one, uh, Emma K Plans said that she thinks that this kit really reminds her of A Court of Th Thorns and Roses, so Akatar, the first book, because she thinks it reminds her of the Spring Court, which is the setting in that book. And this is the week that I read Akatar. So I'd put in this kit because I was like, oh, well, I'll be reading Akatar. I put a vlog up of me reading that. So I thought, okay, that'll be a good fit. I didn't love Akatar though. I am going to read the rest of the series because everyone tells me it gets better from here, but I didn't actually love it. And so I was like, well, going to see Little Mermaid was almost a bigger deal than going to see Akatar. So what do I do? Then this kit came in the post, which was the, uh, it's, what was it? I think it was like Happy Stickers Design four year shop sale. I think the shop has closed now, unfortunately. But this was the exclusive art, which I'm pretty sure is drawn by Dinda of Milk and Berries for her sale. And I felt like this was a really good mix of the two. We've got the new Little Mermaid, but we've also got real fairy tale vibes, like we've got the horse and stuff like that. We've got this that does kind of look like the Spring Court. So we're going with this one now because this kit has so many princesses in it. Like I haven't hauled this kit yet, so I will haul it and I'll go through everything properly. But like we have, I've never had so many tool boxes in my whole life. Um, this kit is just like, it, there's so many boxes. And then we have these additional boxes. And we have character boxes, like, galore. Like, I've honestly never... I've just never had so many. We have even more tool boxes, like, another two pages of them. So it was it will be really hard to like figure out well what do you use this for because it represents so many different fairy tale characters so i was like well it works i'm going to use it for the little mermaid and reading akatar in the same week so i actually think it's kind of perfect i don't usually pick out foil when i'm doing these videos um i just i pick out foil a lot nearer the time because i'm just chaos that way but this one came with this pink foil bundle which is called diana which is a i don't know a, maybe a slightly controversial uh, foil name choice um but yeah it's in pink i don't know if i think this pink actually really goes with this kit though so i may not use the pink i feel like this is going to be like a, a month of hollow though because you could definitely use hollow with fairy tale party but maybe i'll use lavender hollow i also feel like studios would work really well with hollow as well um so i feel like everything goes with hollow at the moment which is rare that i ever think that but yeah we'll see obviously this bundle is kind of meant for this kit though because it's like so princessy but i just don't know that i think this shade of pink is what i would use so we will see but that is the kit for that week is so chunky as well like i almost don't want to store it as well so it's better if i use it then we have the week of the 17th to the 23rd of July, and I'm going to use the Cyber Monday mystery from 2021 from Planner Face. Obviously, I did help Anna with this one. This kit was re-released. I'm not sure if it's still available in the shop, but this is the original version, and it's obviously Games Night themed. This was one of the mysteries that we had this theme suggested so many times, and it took me and Anna a while to figure out how we were going to do it. It just, to, to figure out how to do the, the like, games and stuff, but there was just this one day where everything came to me and I'm so happy with how this kit came out. One of my fave mysteries. And I've decided to use this one because I went to a game night at my friends and you know, I'm, I'm marrying a board gamer. It's like very much Stuart's major hobby is board games. His friends, they all play board games together. So part of me was like, should I save this? But the thing is, I don't really play board games with them. It's very much Stuart's hobby with his friends because I have a lot of like fear and imposter syndrome over gaming. And so this was like a game night that I actually went to for me. And also it was a bit of one of those like wins for anxiety of like I was very nervous about going, but actually like 
it did go well. So yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and use this one and just think that it's so fun. This would also really work with hollow. <laughs> so we can't do a month of hollow. Um, and then the final week that I'm going to be featuring in this lineup video is the 24th to the 30th of July, which was my birthday week. So we're going for this kit, which is perfection, which is Let's Go Party from Squirrel Prince Co. So I know I'm being a bit controversial in not using the, um, is it called Life in the Dream House or like the Barbie art that Kit Nish for the movie. I do have that kit and I could have used it for the week that Barbie came out, which was the week that I'm using the gamer kit. But I saw Barbie on my birthday. So I definitely wanted to use this kit this year. I've had this kit go like in and out of my lineup. I was going to use it as my 30th birthday kit for a while, but I took it out in place of another one. I'm so glad I did because it was literally what I went to do on my birthday was go and watch Barbie. I did a whole week of reading just pink books. I have a vlog up on that. It was a real Barbie week. And so this is just the absolute perfect kit to celebrate my birthday. But then I feel like, well, I don't need to use the other Barbie kit because I didn't watch Barbie in that week. I watched Barbie in this week. So I'm probably just going to save the other Barbie kit. I mean, I do like Barbie. Like in general, I'm very into Barbie. So maybe I could just use it generally for like anything. <laughs> like any week that I'm just I don't know I actually thought I might save it for International Women's Day for next year because it was such a like feminist movie so I may do that but anyway I think I'm happy with my decision to not use it so I'm going to use this kit though because I really love it um I do have various kind of extras like I have this toolbox that I got in um a rack bag so I'm not really sure but like how can you not use the blonde barbie you know this this is very Midge vibes, <laughs> but Midge is probably even more my favourite than Barbie. But I just don't think I can't not use the Barbie box. So we'll have to see. But I love the kid boxes. Um, and in the original version, they were like put together like this. So I'll maybe use the like redhead <laughs> as if they're like Midge kids. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited to use this. So that is my kit lineup for July. This is going to be such a fun month in my planner. I'm so excited to see it all come out. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would really appreciate a like. And if you haven't already, I would love it if you would subscribe. I will have plan with me's up eventually in about three months time for all of these spreads. So I hope you'll stick around to see me chat through the weeks in more detail then. Uh, in the description, I will have a link to all of these shops. I will also have a link to my Instagram and my Goodreads if you want to check out any more content from me. Otherwise, I'll see you in my next video.